the city is seeing its first real dusting of snow today. Toronto currently under a winter weather travel advisory. We're expecting up to maybe five centimeters of snow could fall through to this evening. That'll mean potentially some reduced visibility at times, although most of the live shots we've seen out there uh, showing us that it's not too significant at the moment. However, the weather could impact rush hour traffic, so drivers are being reminded to pay attention to the changing conditions. And Toronto has had its fleet of plows, salters and brining equipment standing by ahead of the wintry weather. The salting begins when the first snow accumulates. Plowing begins on the Down Valley Parkway and Gardner after 2.5 centimetres of snow fall. For major roads, the threshold is 5 centimetres and for residential streets, it's 8. But if you live in Richmond Hill, well, you may not see your snow cleared right away. This is because of an ongoing strike by municipal workers there. cp 24s Courtney Hills is covering uh, this story this morning from the 404 in Major McKenzie, where it is already starting to snow. I can see the flakes on your hat, mm -hmm. Courtney, and very windy where you are. Yeah. Yeah, the snow has arrived in Richmond Hill, guys. It is a little bit cool. It's definitely windy and nothing uh, concerning at this point. And hopefully that is the case going into uh, the day. But there is this really this heads up out to residents of Richmond Hill that uh, your snow removal could be a little bit delayed today. And this has to do with uh, job disruption, uh, labor disruption, I should say, involving municipal 905 workers. These are uh, road maintenance workers who are off the job for almost two weeks now. Let's get some more details on this. I want to bring in uh, Mayor David West with Richmond Hill, who joins us live now this morning morning. Uh, sir, good morning. So what is your message to uh, residents who may be wondering what snow removal could look like later on? Very so to keep our roads and, and uh, safe for motorists and, and other users. Uh, we have um, crews ready to go. They've actually been out all night already uh, doing some salting and getting ready for uh, the event. So we're, you know, we're not expecting huge delays um, in, in our winter maintenance. Like, like we, we, it'll be similar to what we've always had. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's certainly good news. And at this point, I know we're watching the system closely. We're looking at maybe around five centimeters. That's not a lot. But of course, this can catch some people off guard. It's really the first major snow event of the winter. Can you talk to some specifics about these municipal workers who are off the job right now, municipal, uh, the, the QB 905? What is it they do when it comes to road maintenance? Well, there's a, the, the union is, is quite a number of different workers, not just our, our roads maintenance workers. But in terms of the road maintenance, uh, these are the folks that drive our plows and, and so on and, and keep our roads safe. OK, so are there other employees who are able to step in and do, say, for example, the salting? I understand the salting is still going ahead. Yes. So uh, in okay. regular times, we have our, a contractor that takes on um, about half of our city. And uh, so because of the strike, we've got that contractor taking on uh, more responsibilities and, uh, you know, everything, as I said, we, we've started doing the salting already today. And uh, we are out there mm -hmm. uh, getting ready for this event even before it happens. Okay, uh, Mayor, thank you so much for your time this morning. We certainly appreciate your clarity on all of this, and uh, we'll be in touch because it sounds like it could be a busy day. No, thanks very much. Have a great day. Yeah, I'm not okay. Going anywhere. So, Nick, Jennifer, again, you hear the message there is that there are some employees as part of this uh, this job action who are not working right now, been on strike for weeks, and as a result, that means that there could be a bit of a delay in snow removal. A lot of it has to do with just how much snow we see hit the ground later on. We're forecasting about five centimeters of snow. It's also really important to note uh, this doesn't affect regional roads. So those major roads in through Richmond Hill, for example, Young Street, Bathurst, those will also be a priority. They'll be clear. More than neighborhood streets, we could see a bit of a delay. And the same goes for sidewalks. Over to you. Okay, that's a good distinction to make. CP24 is Courtney Hills joining us live from the 404 and Major McKenzie this morning. Thank you.